So there's Comet and there's Atlas. If you don't know, these are both AI internet browsers, kind of like if Chrome and ChatGPT had a baby. However, Comet was made by Perplexity and Atlas by OpenAI. And there are a lot of things that are similar between these two browsers, so I wanna talk about the differences. In terms of each browser's strengths, Comet offers stronger agentic features where it can analyze dozens of tabs at once and share its sources, compare product and price data across pages and perform tasks for you. Now, Atlas also offers all of this, but from my own experience, it's a bit slower than doing it on Comet. Now, Atlas is really great at remembering things for you and acting more like an AI web browsing assistant. So if you say, forgot where you read that one thing last week, you can ask Atlas and it can help dig up that web page for you. Now, as for the user experience, Atlas is a lot more clean and easy to navigate in my opinion. It has a more minimalistic layout and fewer buttons. Whereas it seems like Comet just kind of dumped anything and everything onto the front page, which can be overwhelming for people just dipping their toes into AI browsers. Now let's talk about access. Both are currently available for free. However, Atlas is only available on Mac OS, while Comet is available on both Mac and Windows. Neither of them have a mobile app just yet. And both are Chromium based browsers where you can transfer and add your own extensions, bookmarks, or whatever else you want to transfer over from Chrome itself. If you wanna learn more about how to use both of these and find out about all of the features, I do have full videos up on my YouTube channel for both Atlas and Comet, so check them out if you haven't already.